10 last meals on death row. Lawrence Russell Brewer. Lawrence Russell Brewer's last meal inspired the state of Texas to cease this tradition. It wasn't what he requested, but instead what he did with his meal. Brewer requested a triple bacon cheeseburger, two chicken fried steaks with gravy and onions, a cheese and beef omelet, tomatoes, a meat lover's pizza, bell peppers, jalapenos, a bowl of okra, one pound of barbecue meat, half a loaf of bread, three fully loaded fajitas, three root beers, a pint of ice cream, and a slab of peanut butter fudge. This certainly put the kitchen staff on high alert, but what ticked everyone off was, when he refused to eat a single bite of his epic last meal. John Wayne Gacy. John Wayne Gacy was the infamous killer clown who raped and killed 33 boys and young men, keeping their bodies in his home. He was convicted in 1980 and was sentenced to death, which took place in 1994. For his last meal, Gacy requested 12 pieces of fried shrimp, a bucket of original KFC fried chicken, french fries, and a pound of strawberries. Timothy McVeigh. Timothy McVeigh was the terrorist responsible for the Oklahoma City bombing in 1995. He was convicted of terrorism and mass murder and sentenced to the death penalty. He was executed in 2001, but before his death, he requested a last meal of two pints of mint chocolate chip ice cream. Clarence Ray Allen. Clarence Ray Allen was the second oldest inmate to be executed at the age of 76. He was convicted of three counts of murder in 1980, but wasn't executed until 2006. He was a diabetic and suffered a heart attack in 2005. With these health issues, that might have been why Allen had a healthy last meal, which consisted of buffalo steak, fried chicken, and sugar-free pecan pie, and sugar-free walnut ice cream. William Bonin. Known as the Freeway Killer, William Bonin committed some despicable crimes, including the rape and murder of 21 boys and a young man. He was imprisoned in San Quentin, California, and requested two pepperoni pizzas and three helpings of chocolate ice cream as his last meal. He was also chugging Pepsi and Coca-Cola the night before his execution, apparently trying to kill himself from diabetes. Robert Buell Robert Buell became an overnight celebrity after he was accused and convicted of the rape and murder of 11-year-old Krista Harrison in 1982. He was convicted in 1984, but he was not executed until 2002. His last meal request was rather odd, as he requested a single black olive unpitted. Miguel Richardson Miguel Richardson had killed two security guards at a Holiday Inn in San Antonio, Texas in 1979. He wasn't arrested until 1980 and was sentenced to death in 1981, but he wouldn't be executed until 2001. His last meal request was very sentimental, as he requested a birthday cake with the date 2 which was his wedding date. He also requested a lot of fruit and a salad with Thousand Island dressing. Ronnie Lee Gardner Ronnie Lee Gardner was convicted of two counts of murder in 1985 and sentenced to death. He sat on death row for 25 years and finally received his last meal. Gardner's last meal consisted of lobster tail, steak, apple pie, and vanilla ice cream. Also, he wanted to enjoy his meal while watching the Lord of the Rings trilogy. Jonathan Nobles. Jonathan Nobles was convicted of killing two women in 1986, and he was sentenced to the death penalty. During his time in prison, Nobles had become a devout Christian and spent about 12 years in prison before he was executed in 98. His Last Supper was literally the Last Supper from the Bible, as he requested the Holy Communion, which consisted of bread and wine. Thomas Grasso Thomas Grasso was convicted of two murders, one being the strangulation of an 87-year-old woman and the other the killing of an 81-year-old man six months later. He only spent two years and five months on death row before he was executed. Grasso's last meal was extravagant, consisting of two dozen steamed mussels, two dozen steamed clams, a cheeseburger, half a dozen spare ribs, two strawberry milkshakes, strawberries, half of a pumpkin pie, and a can of spaghetti with meatballs. But the meal wasn't perfect. He requested SpaghettiOs, not spaghetti. This inspired his famous last words, I did not get my SpaghettiOs, I got spaghetti. I want the press to know this. We hope you found this video interesting and maybe made you a little bit hungry. Don't forget to click subscribe and here's a couple other videos that we think you might like. Thanks.